to write it out on the bottom. I'm going to write it on the bottom. And this video could be a hot mess. Alepo Nore. I'm going to be using my own dialect, where dialect, because that's what helps me. And I'm going to try my best. I'm going to try to write it out on the bottom. I mentioned before you can't, you can't really write a where a dialect out, but I'm going to try my best to, to write it out on the bottom. I'm going to write it on the bottom. And this video could be a hot mess. Again, I just want to commend my parents for speaking Igbo to us because it's how we understood most words. I can't speak it full out, but I understand most words. And that's the same I'm going to do with my kids. If it's God's will for me to become a mom, my children are going to be speaking Igbo, learning Igbo, writing Igbo, all of that. This video, as you can tell, is the third part of this series. For this particular video, it's going to be pronouns, nouns, and verbs. And I might throw little questions in here. Let's get started. First, I'm going to start with nouns. So this category is person. There's no I or me in Igbo. Instead, it sounds like pigeon. Me, me. It sounds like drink too in a word dialect. You can also say me for drink. But there's no, there's not really an I or me if you want to say someone or who, it's onye, onye. Next is mother, mom, ne, and then father, dad, na. Careers, you don't really have careers in Igbo. It looks like pigeon to me. Like doctor would be dakta. Am I saying it? Dokta, dokta. Or nurse, nos, nos. Am I, if I'm pronouncing it, saying it with the right accent. So there's not really careers in Igbo. It sounds like pidgin to me, pidgin English, with an accent. But teacher is onya inkusi, teaches inkusi, and the teacher is onya inkusi. If you want to say grandma in a word dialect, in my household we call grandma mama, ma kuku, mama kuku, which literally translates to Big mother, big ma, magi kuku, is grandma, and the same thing is said with pa, grandpa, is pagi kuku, which literally translates to big pa. If you want to say child, is wa, wa. There's also variations. What I use at home, aware dialect, one takere, one takere. And there's another one I can't say. There's another one I can't say. Wakure. Wakure. I don't know how to say it. I feel like the R is more pronounced. But that's how you say child. Mwa. Then the plural form of child, which is children. Umu. Umbu. Umu de. Umu ndeke. That person's children. Sister would be. Wanegi wan. Wanegi wan is sister. And it literally translates to your mother's child that's a woman, girl. Brother would be the same thing instead of wani, it would be woke. Waneki woke. That's brother. Which literally translates to your mother's child that's a man, boy. For niece, it would be wa wa negi wani. Which literally translates to your mother's child. That's a woman's child. Nephew would be wa 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 nigi woki, which literally translates to your mom's child. That's a man's child. Cousin would be wa wa ne na. Wife would be wa ni, the same as woman. Husband will be different. It will be di, la di, or dim, my husband. Forgot to mention, friend is any. To say girlfriend is any one. Any one. One. Guy friend, boyfriend would be any moki. Guy friend is any moki. Any moki. My guy friend. Anale. The generalized Igbo is them. All of them. 
Ozubomo in a wear dialect. In my household, we call it all of them. Ahau, ahau, is that, ahau, is that. If you're trying to say them, ndiki, ndiki, in a wear dialect. But also correct me if I'm wrong, if it's in generalized central Igbo too. Generalized Igbo. Next is thing. Chair is uche. Light is aku. You heard this previously in the Nigerian alphabet video. Clothes is uwe. Bed sheet is aqua. 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 I'm sure you all heard of the three aquas. Aqua. 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 Bed is aqua. And then cry is aqua. And then egg is aqua. If I'm pronouncing egg correctly. All of them correctly. I'm trying here. But I understand most words. An Igbo. Car is motu. It's not really an Igbo. Correct me down below in the comments if there's a word for an Igbo word for car that I'm forgetting. But the way in my family how I use it is motu. Motu. Which sounds like pigeon English to me. Plate is ifere. You heard this previously in the Nigerian alphabet video. Pa is ite. Ma is ute. Door is uzo. Medicine is agu. Agu. Fish, you want to say fish, is azu. Next is place. House, as you learn from the Nigerian alphabet video, is ulo. Water, the same thing you learn from the Nigerian alphabet. The Igbo alphabet. I keep on saying Nigerian. Igbo alphabet video. Water is miri. 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 Living room. The way I call it in my household, where dialect is palo. Mountain is ugu, ugu. I also forgot pronouns, her, she, and it's basically the same, ya. Ya mia, or it is the same. I don't know why, but ya is just general for all of them. Next is verb. When you're trying to say where is su, suru we, su or suru, su we, suru we, wear your clothes, wear clothes. Cry is, we already went over this. Bakwa, bakwa, apichanam. I've cried. Turn off, I'm sure you heard this a little bit in the Igbo, Igbo alphabet. Banyoku, banyoku. It's using the GB, I didn't notice it before, but it's using the GB. Banyoku, turn off the light. Turn off is banyo. Stop is kushi, kushi yao. Mary is Lodi. Mary is Law. Lodi. Mary, your husband. Remove in the generalized Igbo is Wipu. Wipu Hau. But in my dialect, where dialect is Patuo Hau. So in the generalized Igbo, remove is Wipu. Wipu. And then aware dialect is Patuo. Cook, if you want to say cook. Ishiri. Ishiri. Oshiri. Ishiri. That's generalized Igbo. Aware dialect. Ishiri. Ishiri. If you're trying to say leave. Lapo. Lapo. Ngoa lapo. Okay, leave. Lapo is leave. Go is ga. We can say gawa. Close is mishi hiam. Mishi. Close. That's how you say close. Take is wede. It looks as it spells out as were, but the way to pronounce it is wede. Sing, if you want to say sing, is guavu, guavu, guavu. Dance is bachavu, bachavu. To ask, joya, ajolamia, joya. Where dialect is ajolamia. Drink, we already went over this. It's one, one midi, one in the Igbo alphabet video. To drink is one, one midi, drink water. Or wagu, take your medicine, drink your medicine. To wait is chere. In my dialect, how we say it in my household, cherekula, cherekula. 
to talk is iku ikuka you talk ikuka and finally it's questions if you're trying to say when is mi bole mi bole mbole mbole that's how you say when mbole what is gini or in a where dialect is nini where is ebe ebao ebao over there ebe is where why is makagini makagini all right that's all i have for this video comment down below of words i didn't mention if you're nigerian Igbo and what they mean because i know i didn't mention a lot of them but that's it for this video see you in the next series which is sentences putting it all together using the numbers the words i just went over see you in the next video